No, it's been a great start comparing to um, comparing to last season. If you look fitness-wise, the players has done the individual work, work very good in December and in January. So we start on a much higher level, and so far, fingers crossed, no injuries. And I must say, every player looked sharper than last year. It's been good, you know, just getting back into rhythm. Uh, we got a lot of faces, a lot of guys, so you know, getting to know everybody. And uh, you know, turf's been a little tough so far, but uh, you know, we're excited to to go away and, and really get going. Everybody came in pretty fit, um, you know, much much more fit than they were last year, and you know, I think myself included. The the sessions have been intense, you know. Nobody's, you know, everybody's stepping up. Nobody wants to lose out here, and the the young guys coming in, I mean, they're they're all good players. Um, you know, they all bring something to the table that you know they're they're going to contribute this year, and you know that's good to see. So this is the first time I'll be in Mexico, and uh, you know, a nice facility, and then we have a, a couple good games, competitive games, so it should be good for us. It's still to get them uh, fitness-wise as top trained as possible to start doing the tactical work as also a priority. But even the games, uh, the friendlies, we take very seriously on every game. And uh, I think it's, it's, we should start rather early to find a team who could be the first 11 uh, March 19. But still, anyhow, every player has to get a fair chance in the, in the friendly games. Yeah, last year uh, it was Spain. It was really nice, but I think this year, being in Mexico, knowing the food, knowing uh, the language, knowing the people, you know, I think it's going to be different. It's going to be, uh, even though we're there for uh, practice, I think that's going to help me. And almost everyone in the team, the good weather and the nice place over there. The players like Rafa and Ri, they're known worldwide. So, um, but Rafa, he's role model in Mexico everywhere. So, I think it's going to be every, everywhere we go. I think it's going to be crowded. Just, uh, just the pressure, you know, from the people. But I think we should just go there and go there and have fun. Do our, do our preseason training. When we we'll play the Mexican teams, it will be a lot of possession from the Mexican teams. Very patient in the attacking game, uh, individually very good technicals. So it's not like playing against MLS teams, but anyhow, to uh, to just get some experience against good sides in Mexico will help us. I've been following the Mexican league since I was little. Now playing in a big stadium like Chivas Stadium, that's going to be a big deal, you know. So hopefully we do a good job over there and just stay focused on on preseason, which is to get ready for the league. We will probably stay almost the same as last season, try to improve both defending, attacking, repeat that kind of tactical work. So uh, I don't, we will not experimental that much. We will small, small um, differences. It's a long preseason, a lot of weeks, uh, you know, fitness games involved. So you don't want to burn yourself out the first two weeks. So basically it's just, you know, Slow and steady, and uh, it's a long season, so they'll pick up. But uh, we got a lot of new faces, a lot of new guys coming in, and uh, you know we're, we're all excited about it. Coming in first in the Eastern Conference last year, you know there's there's a you know a target on our back now. Um, obviously, you know we we expect to win, and you know I think everybody came in here um, and you know is coming here this this year wanting to do that and more. Um, you know we've we've won the Eastern Conference, but that's not good enough for us. And you know that's that's what a lot of guys have been talking about, and that's what you know coaches have been talking about. And you know we just want to step up and and go even farther.